All right, Shippo, this is the main nice patch note. Uh, I won't be able to do the proper patch notes for next week, but for this week, I will should be able to do this one. All right, let's go. Uh, so the first one is uh, two units got the uh, three, four, five units got the wait, one, two, three. Oh, you did got the um, uh, little bit of a change in skills, and then two you need got the um, SS upgrade. So uh, whether you want to do it or not, that's up to you. I uh, don't really care. So let's go through them one by one. Hopefully fast. I don't want to spend too much on that one. All right. So first is the uh, Spatoria, Spatoria. So her active one, you know, it's actually a pretty good one. It's wrong tech. Um, suppose you remove the added the um, debuff increase. Uh, removal so enemy will has a buff on the debuff will remove it by doing the first active that's all we ask all right so second skill is her hp is going to be based on the so damage will be based on the um enemy's hp so I think lower their animation, you got more damage. And the um, she originally had the uh, shield and the demon uh, damage reduction ignore, but that has been gone, eh, which is pretty bad. But it's it's okay. Um, uh, you'll get the minus 19% attack decrease and 9.5 damage increase if you actually land the hit. And I don't. Wait, why can I do this? So if enemy doesn't have the. Uh, one of these, uh, you will get more uh, damage boost from there. So that's what it is. All right, first passive. So the it's completely reworked. Increased damage, increased range, increased accuracy. Um, uh, if you get the third buff of attack every round, you get this buff, and every, well, not only the attack. And if you get the um, Attack three times. If you get buff three times, you get a 95% accuracy. This was a pretty useless. All right, second passive. Um, you get a first attack is gonna get the very high armor penetration of a 76%, and then you get lower and lower every time you attack up to war. So. It's okay ish. And yeah, it's it's mad. Alright, her SS, so she get the attack critical chance, you know, all increase. Um her AP is increased, but her speed is reduced at the beginning of the thing. Uh but she get the AP and the speed decrease resistance so that'll be interesting to see so she'll be a more like uh, you can either use her for like the first skill to clear a row or you can use it that's one but it's still kind of mad in my first opinion all right second one is the fancy so her let's see 
her first yeah her active skill didn't change but she got the SS rank um, so uh, NT heavy is low all right so it depends on the active you get a different uh, either NT heavy or NT flying uh, you get slow and but deadly is ready. Um, if you have, yeah. So it depends on the uh, what you use. You know, either this or this. You get an empty heavy or empty fly. For this one, if you shoot weight, her speed is decreased quite a lot. But if you get a special buff, and if you get a special buff, her AP is changed to, you know, whatever the amount. Uh, it's going to be different, depends on the level. And then it's going to even enemies defense, and then uh, damage reduction is going to be completely ignored. So there will be a kind of a new way to do it if she wait a turn. And she'll be able to do maybe three times, four times. Yeah, only two times, not much. So that's it for the uh, fancy. All right, next is uh, boots. Where's my boots? So for second active, she used to remove the accuracy, decrease accuracy. That has been uh, completely gone. Um, and doesn't matter. <coughs> yeah, it's supposed to reduce uh, evasion, but that has been gone. And depends on whether she hit it or the enemy or not, uh, it removes the uh, evasion buff. So, pretty neat, you know. Um, yeah, that's what it is. Her first skill is completely gone. 75%, uh, 57% um, armor penetration. And if you get an Empress's Hound unit in the team, you get an armor and the damage reduction ignore. So if you have the uh, Chana in there, there's only one, so. And her, you know, second passive, her critical chance from 100% to 150%? Oh, damage is increased by that. Uh, her critical chance doesn't decrease anymore after you kill enemy. Oh yeah, she got a permanent critical reduction. But if you get the uh, protected, uh, her uh, critical chance removal is no longer applied. Yeah, yeah, so she has... 150% critical chance, but every enemy, enemy dies, her critical chance decrease, but that can be removed if she's being protected. All right. Third passive. So, Lance Star, she supports the uh, protection or support, and if she have two or more allies near, she get an armor penetration. If there's a four, um, she get a more damage on the uh, AOE damage. Okay, it's a little good. It's even more supportive time. Um, but usually you just use a single, so we'll see. It's not bad actually. Decent ish. Alright, next one is Isis. Do I have her? Where's my ISIS? 
Oh, she's happy. There you go. She's happy. So her first active her the unable to work uh do anything increased to two round. Uh you don't have any more armor reduction trigger uh, but amount of the defense decrease has been uh, reduced to 57% alright and the second passive is uh, it is no longer she, she can still use uh, so she wasn't be able to use any skill after using a skill now that has been removed so you can spam it uh, for press passive, our protection has been increased if she used the second skill, the first skill. No, is it? Okay, if she's the only uh, protector, uh, protector in the game, I think she get a buff, and that uh, duration has been increased to two rounds, so she'll protect the two more round two rounds instead of one um she get a counter attack has been edited uh she get a, the um row and a column protection if her first passive is triggered all right the last one is the uh, amount of the defense increase and the you know the um, AOE damage reduction has been in uh, the the skill increase has been increased slightly, so she'll be okay-ish, but we'll see. I still don't. It's too expensive at this point. Heavy inventory has to be really good. All right. Um, the lastly, you got the broken image for. Boots, uh, Caskin, the boots, where is it? Uh, yeah, boot may skin got the la broken one. You go watch yourself. All right, uh, there has been added it for the lobby stickers, so you can buy them from here. Where is it? If you want, it's a sticker that goes to lobby. If you want to buy, you buy. Um, the the contract dialogue has been added for Pinto and Frost. All right, and the um, there's a lot of description that has been fixed, and nothing has uh, changed. Just description and some bugs on there, but I won't go that detail today. Alright, I'll see you sheeples later.